like other Microsoft software, you have an insert tab. This will have a range of functions, but if you want to put something into your document, chances are you'll find it in this tab. This includes headers, footers, page numbers, symbols and special characters, inserting new pages, and applying borders and building blocks. Unlike Microsoft Word, you need to tell Publisher that you want to insert a new page. To do this, select the Insert tab and select Page. Please note that some different documents will come with a preset number of pages in them. For example, if you're making a booklet and you've selected half A4, this means that your A4 page is folded in half, creating four pages. You'll see this in the page navigation window on the side. Alternatively, if you're making something like a brochure, you'll need two pages. One to contain the three panels of text on one side, and the other to contain the three panels of text on the other side. If you want to insert a header, footer, or page number into your document, select the Insert tab and find the header and footer group. You can then select header, footer, or page number to insert. If you need to insert a symbol or a special character, simply select your text box, select the Insert tab, and then find the Symbol option. If you can't see yours in the drop-down, select the More Symbols option and scroll through until you can find the one you want. To insert a border, select the Insert tab and then find the Borders and Accents drop-down. In this drop-down, you'll find a range of bars, emphasis and frames that you can use in your documents. Simply select one, place it in your document, and then drag and hold. Please note that you don't have to go and insert the bars one by one. If you drag to resize them, they'll automatically replicate themselves. If you just wanted to do a real simple, easy border, you could always insert just a square shape around the outside of your document. And then you can adjust the fill to no fill and then work on the outline colors and the weight. Sometimes this is easier and creates a better look than using preset border options.